Right guys, <laughs> I'm all comfortable now. I've just finished, there's the evidence. I've just finished my apple pies. Um, uh, I've got custard blow my finger. <laughs> um, it's been a good day. It's been a really good day. I got up this morning, took the boys out um, to an airfield. I thought I could do an airfield walk this morning. So I went up Lavenham Airfield and the sun came up at 10 to five. So 4.50 and I thought, oh, that was so pretty guys. I wish I'd taken, I had my camera, I took one photo, but I wish I'd taken more. Uh, if it does the same tomorrow, I shall take more photos tomorrow. But it was so pretty, really, really nice. So the day got off to a really good start. Um, so I came home, fed the dogs, had my breakfast, and then when I went to work, it was so sunny, I left my coat at home. I thought, it's a lovely day, I'm not gonna need my coat. Ah, big mistake, <laughs> big mistake. It poured down, guys. Um, it was all right first thing in the morning. I got to work, it was lovely and sunny still. Got into the workshop, it's lovely. Doors are open, the sun was coming in. It was really nice. Um, then mid-morning towards dinner time, it changed. It started getting really dark, started to drizzle, and then it just set in for the day, guys. So it was a rubbish day after that. So that's such a shame. I uh, got off to such a good start. Um, so yeah, I also got a, a an apprentice just for the week. Um, the service manager came through the workshop with a young lad with him and he introduced him to everybody, showed him around. And then he came back to me, this young lad, and he said to me, um, would you be willing to have this young lad as your apprentice for the week? He said he's here on work experience and he said, I need to put him with somebody. Would you be willing to take him for the week? And I said, yeah, that's fine. So he comes in at nine in the morning and he finishes at four o'clock in the afternoon. And he's a great lad, he is really good, but he doesn't know what he wants to do. I can't see that he's cut out for the motor trade, but yeah, it's good. It's lovely to see the younger generation coming through and, and, and learning things. And yeah, so that was really good fun. That was enjoyable. Um, so other than that, a very wet day. <laughs> I haven't looked at the weather for the rest of the week. I'm not gonna bother. I'm just gonna take it day by day, guys. Um, so I got dressed when I got home. I got changed, went and had a shower. And I've been out obviously to Tesco's because I ran out of bread. So I thought, well, I'll get dressed, I'll nip out to Tesco's. I put a woolly pulley on and some jeans just for tonight um, because it's really windy and it's very drizzly still. So yeah, so all done. So I'm home, that's it. I'm gonna have an early night tonight uh, because I didn't sleep very well last night. I had too many things going on in my mind. So yeah, I'm gonna have an early night and I shall speak to you guys later. Okay, bye-bye.